Looks like there was a new update for RoboQuest today. This is, I think this is a pretty old game at this point. I'm not even sure if it's in full release or, or still early access, but uh, it's fun. I don't think we've ever played it on the channel. Saw that there was an update, so figured why not? Let's play it today. So this is slightly different than what our normal fare would be. Still kind of your, your typical roguelike. Uh, but we're we're playing uh, some FPS. Um, well, I don't even know what what character we're at. Where do we switch characters? Class area. How about that? Okay. Uh, oh, uh, apparently I haven't even unlocked everything since they did this last major update. Who do we want? Let's play this uh, engineer. We can have a little buddy. We can have the little buddy f following us around. And we'll just we'll just go into the game. So this this update is supposed to have added a bunch of, of weapons or changed weapons to the game. T, new upgrade. All right, what are we doing? Energy weapons, fire rate. Probably just do fire rate. Explosion, ooh, explosion damage and radius. Let's do that. Explosions are fun. We get our we get our free weapon here. Uh, we've seen that weapon, elephant gun. That is explosive. We will probably take that. I mean, it it looks really good. So yeah, we just run around and kill stuff. Try not to die. Our first gun feels not too bad. There's kind of like a, a time component to this a little bit. So you don't want to dilly dally too much. These we on the mini map in the top right, you see like we go into this different colored area. That's like a, a special side area where this is like optional, but we should be able to get a new gun or something. If we do this, and this is usually like a jump puzzle of some sort, and they get more difficult the further, whoa, the further you go into the game. So that was a nice easy one. Dragon Mortar, I mean, we're probably gonna take that. Increases summon damage, but reduces weapon damage. I don't think we're taking that. I don't think I've ever seen that one before. All right, Dragon Mortar. Yeah, it's got a bunch of mods on it. And, oh, can we only equip, there we go. What's our right click on this thing? Oh, like a rocket jump. Very nice. Can be useful. Oh no, that guy's like a bonus XP if we kill him. I was panicking there. Our uh, our new gun, not... Oh, a gun dropped on the ground over here. We better go have a peek at it. Comet Cannon. Um, I think I like the elephant gun a little more. Says this thing is better. I think I like this elephant gun. It's kind of just does what you want it to do. So now this is like our, our kind of a rest area. Splasher rifle. Bouncing projectiles. Forking projectiles. Arc wave. Fires a long range piercing. That must be the right click? Yeah, that's the right click. Dart spitter, that sounds boring. Dual rascals, that sounds boring. Cryo crit damage. I mean, I'm, I'm pretty tempted to just try this this gun out. Oh, we, we got a level up too. Explosions have a 40% chance to trigger a second time. I mean... That, that sounds pretty good to go with what we took the first time. But we also have 
some stuff for our drones, which also sounds good. More drones, less damage, less health. When we summon the drones, they start super blasting for six seconds. Let's just continue with the explosions for now. Even though we're currently not using an explosions gun. Uh, little secret here. It's a 141. If you're playing this game and you come here and you see this code, remember the code because it gets you into a secret area later on. Okay, the splasher rifle seems okay. We kind of just want explosions though. I like having explosions. They're pretty explodey. Did I miss an enemy there? It was giving me indicators that there was like an enemy behind us. Gotta try to get that, the uh, bonus XP, dude. Still kind of getting in the groove of our controls again as well. Don't think we're doing fantastic with the drones or the controls just yet. Okay. We completed we completed this uh, level. We got an S ranking. So that's like basically number of enemies killed, how fast you did it. And a hot tip, you can hit the space bar to jump while you're on that side or the, the change the level screen. So now we can spend some of our resources. You can see them in the top right. Increases non-burn. Reduces the duration of stuff on us. That's pretty good. Opening a door for 12 seconds. That's kind of, that's actually not terrible. What is this? What? I think this is all new since I last played. Interesting. Damage against elite Goliaths and bosses. Um, I think we just take that. Can we take it? Can we just buy it again? No. We cannot. Oh, does that uh, does that attach to our weapon? Oh no. Okay, we didn't realize that. That was not as good as we initially thought. Another free chest. Two power cells. 19 damage to enemies damaging you. Kaboom grenade. I, I kind of want to just take it. Reloads your other weapon on a takedown. Ah, oh, we, we got to we gotta try it. Oh, no. Oh, no, it's terrible. <laughs> oh, no, it's so bad. <laughs> Oh no, it's so hard to use. Oh no. I mean, we don't have to use it. There is that. There is that aspect of things. Okay, maybe the, the secret is just lobbing... Lobbing short throws. I mean, it does do a boatload of damage when it does pop off. Explosion auto crit chance. Are we just fully committing on explosions? Okay, and like as you can see, th these start to get slightly, slightly more difficult, but still right now, fairly easy. Uh, looks like these are not what we want. That's okay. That was that wasn't difficult, so 
We're all right with that. This thing does no initial damage. That's the that's the big problem there. But I mean, it does do a lot of damage when it does hit. We can kind of play a little little more cautious with it, I guess. I don't know. The the dragon mortar just kind of feel maybe feels a little better. I don't even think we can get this flying guy. We're very going to be very bad at getting people out of the air. We'll, we'll just ignore him. We do want to go to this area, though. Oh, we did. Uh, we got ourselves very trapped there. That was not ideal. Okay, though. Hey, we got the, we got the <laughs> guy on the rail. Okay, we definitely need a different weapon. Probably just like that original elephant gun we had. We want to stay explosions. I mean, this thing does seem to punch out damage. All right, so this is the one for one thing. I've already, I've already been here, so don't have to punch it in. But you punch that code in, opens this door. There is a secret. Oh, we can, might actually be able to get up there. You push this, explode everybody, get a free level up. Oh, we can just go up here. I mean, we got to do it, right? Let's level up first. Increase crit damage by 25%. Taking down an enemy with crit damage triggers an explosion. Interesting. Choose an element. When, gather, when a scrap generates charges, gathering a scrap generates charges. When fully charged, it increases your armor and triggers an explosion. Hmm. I think we'll take this scrap explosion. We were a little slower on that one. Hey, see? Jumping van. Alright, what's going on here? we got to get rid of this kaboom grenade. Pulsar. Oh, this is... Oh, we got we to gotta buy this guy. It is heat-seeking and explosive. Yeah, we're, we're taking it. Oh yeah, we like that uh, a lot. Upgrade the quality. I think we're okay on that. 6% armor while in hand, crit damage. What are you doing? Upgrade. That I think this is the stars? But we, we won't do that either. We'll just save all our stuff for now. Get our health, look at our free stuff. Power cells. Increasing healing cells duration, that's actually okay. No explosive tags on those weapons, so no thank you. Yeah, we'll grab this cucumber. It's probably fine. Let's see how we feel about this gun. What does our right click do? Oh, our right click is just like a big orb. The, the seeking portion of our bullets seems uh, not fantastic. Not sure what the that bar is in the, the top center of our screen. We got to do three things probably to win, to escape this zone maybe. Uh, would like to start doing a better job of not getting hit. We're getting hit quite a bit, and that will be bad for us. The further into the game we get. 
Because shockingly, taking damage is uh, bad. No one saw that revelation coming in. And yet here we are. Okay. What you got for us? Oh, we have to jump through the center. We took some damage. Okay, Kuboom Grenade, no thanks. I mean, that still is a lot of damage. Weapon ammo by 50%, but decreases reload speed by 30%. I think we can take that. Does that also apply to energy weapons like what we're using? That have the 100% the bar. So that could actually be super bad for the energy weapons. We're, we're playing a little bit passive. Which is, is fine. But uh, it's going to be hard for us to recoup our health if we're not getting in there and, and picking up the, the health orbs that are constantly dropping. Oh, who got us from behind? We didn't even know you were there. I mean, this, this gun does feel strong. Coat totally forgot about our right click ability there. Because we can probably like sit just out of sight of uh, some of the enemies sometimes and just blast our rifle. I mean, we don't. I don't think we care about this. No, I was correct. Okay, mandatory for us to win here. So correct me if I'm wrong, but we can just run down here and ro rocket jump and kind of bypass everything. Igniter gun. I mean, it sounds really good. Does not have the explosive tag. So we ignore it. 39 damage... Per to enemies damaging you, but taking damage has a 10% chance to freeze you. Absolutely not. We're not taking something that's going to freeze us. Come on, game. We take damage all the time. That would just mean we take more damage. It is a decent chunk of damage to enemies damaging us. Okay, what was going on there? These enemies are trying to get a little nasty. And we don't like that. This is a no nasty zone. If you want to be nasty, take your ball and go somewhere else. I don't ever remember giving anybody permission to just get nasty, okay? Okay, our third, this should be our third little puzzle zone. Oh, we got a, we got a new upgrade. Increase explosion damage when hitting multiple enemies. I actually don't think that's very good. <clears throat> uh, it will help with our clear though. Our current weapon is doing very small explosive radiuses. Let's, let's hit a reroll. We have two. Transform blaster into ray, which can apply crit damage. Uh, we never even hit that button. We have, we have an, a button that we never even hit. 
Let's do this crit damage. I like having the little bit of Seekers. Just because I'm old, I'm not very good at aiming. It just helps with the aim a little bit. That's all. Okay, this one seems not too bad. We'll probably get hit. We didn't get hit. Look at us go. Blaster deals burn damage, but using it as a 10% chance. I, d I really dislike the negatives on some of these in, the, in this game. Uh, the Shredder looks hilarious. Absolutely not. Okay, we did our three side areas. Let's get the heck out of here. Oh, you sneaky boy. I thought we weren't going to get anybody till this corner. But you have tricked me. And not appreciated. Okay, we should be going into a boss room here. What is this? What is this red ticket? Don't know. Don't know what that is. Never seen that before. Uh, taking now burning. Well, we're not doing any burning. That's not bad, actually. Oh, this is great. We got to take this one, right? Just bonus stats for us. Now we're broke. Um, mm, I think we're good. I think we are good here. What boss do we get? Ooh, I've never fought this boss. El Mos... Mostico? Okay, you're dropping stuff on the ground, which we, we don't like, we don't care for. Our gun seems to be standing up quite well. This fight does not seem too bad so far. Uh, why are you flashing red? So many exploders. Ah, oh, we got hit. We made it pretty far into this fight without getting hit. Pretty proud of ourselves. What? Is there two mosquitoes? Mosticos? Yeah, we did end up taking a big chunk of damage there at the end. Claim power crystal. Red crystal claim. No clue what that means. I'm just going to assume that we did something good there. Uh, don't have much resources for this this time. Uh, taking down an enemy with a blaster. No thank you. Every six seconds. Your next shot fires an explosive. Wow, we don't have enough for that. Every four seconds while crouched. Okay. I think we're happy with what we got. Let's take our health. Shock damage. We're not doing any of that. I mean, Typhoon minigun. This thing sounds amazing. Fires an explosive marking shot. That's only the right click, though. I mean, this thing does sound ridiculous. We might have to just take it just to see. Do we just stay with our, our big uh, explode again? Oh, we can we can take that typhoon. Down the water slide. Into the zone of death. Oh, we, we went in deep. This may have been a mistake. OK, 
Okay, that was... Oh, we took damage after. Oh, I thought we were, like, going to leave there almost at full health. Was it? We didn't take much damage, though. Oh, took so much damage. I got, I got greedy there. Got greedy. Paid for it. Oh, you sneaky boy. Well, those are those are our guys. I was trying to sh trying to shoot those those dudes. Well, when we kind of get the angles just right, this gun does just obliterate things off in the distance. So they like to put a sneaky guy right at the front. All right, let's check our explosive when hitting multiple. We already said no to that. Increase weapons auto crit chance. I think we can take that. More crits. We took some crit damage stuff. What gun did you drop for us over here? Junk beam. Um, I'm actually don't think I'm going to do that side area. They kind of start to get harder. And I don't think we really get much benefit out of it. Our, our little sidekick robots, we've not noticed them this run. Oh, that was bad. That was bad. Do need to clean up our play a little bit. We've been we've been good enough so far. Definitely not going to end up taking either either of those. Gorilla Bolter. I mean, does does seem pretty solid as far as explosive weapons go, but I think we just pass. Get our health. Let's check our free tiny bicycle. Why is this glowing this color? Is this a legendary? Every one second, generate one charge. Increases your next ability damage by 20% per charge. We'll probably take that. Head bonks. Yeah, let's just grab it. So it would increase the damage of that. See, does it, when I right click, does that consume that? No. What consumes it? Okay, our blaster, which we don't use, consumes it. Unlock door, we don't have the key. Apparently, there are secrets in the game we have yet to unlock. I don't even know what our right click does. Like, is it just a direct damage thing? It's all about just getting some damage out into the world. Right now. And... And uh, not worrying about it. That little bit of homing on the projectiles are very strong. Oh, look at this. Still get, you're getting sneaky now with bigger enemies. Did we kill? Did we kill that thing? I don't know if we did or not. Oh. Okay. 
Okay, now we're good. I said we're good as as I run into the room and take more damage. Yeah, also our our special ability. Oh, this is bad. This is very bad. This is very very bad. Our special ability does a boatload of damage now. Unfortunately, it is on a horrible key for us to use. I need to probably rebind that to like one of my mouse buttons. Oh, I died in this room. So this room is, hey, just kill a boatload of enemies. Ooh, that level up might've saved us though. I think we use our reroll here. Choose an additional weapon for your drones. Hmm. Let's just grab this gun diet. Oh, we something happened here that's not good. Oh, we did so bad in that room. But we're live. We're live and we can recover. Oh, this is going to be another bad start getting into this room. No! Almost got super stuck there. Hopefully that guy died. We need that guy dead very badly. That is a big dude. What is up with that dude? Please be a heal room. We need it. We need a heal real bad. We got our heal room. It's actually been a pretty good run. We've kind of been stuck on this. Oh, what is this? Oh no, this is a six digit password. We do not know that password. Interesting. I might have to figure out what that password is. Okay, we're probably gonna take this torpedo rifle, similar to what we're using. But uh, should just be a little better. Okay, let's let's try this out. Okay, we're cool with that. I don't think we're spending any of our resources here. Upgrade this. T that That's a little tempting. Swapping weapons? No, we're not into swapping weapons. All damage against bosses. We, we're, we'll grab that. I think this gun feels like it's hitting a little harder for us. Okay, somebody's bouncing around here. Bouncy boy, we don't like you. Yeah, this gun, this gun feels like it's doing very good for us. Purple area, I say we don't bother with that. At these high levels, they're just a good way to take a bunch of damage. We'd like to we'd like to put it together a nice solid run for everybody. Yeah, this this gun feels much better. Oh, is this a room of death? <clears throat> All right, we've got another one of these rooms of death. 
We basically lost all of our health in this type of room last time. Our damage seems to be a lot better, which is just helping progress us progress through the room a lot faster. Ah. No. Don't die here. I almost called myself my old internet name, a boar. But no, we're we're slayed by gaming. I used that name for years, Boar. And then all of a sudden I started playing games and it was just, and no matter what the game was, it was just like gone. Plus I was like signing up for the game day one and uh, I was like, who is, who is stealing that name? But uh, I think it means something in a different language. So that answers that question. Every six seconds, your next reload instantly refills 50% of your ammo. That's kind of interesting. Let's try it. Secret room? No, it's not a secret room. Taking down an enemy with a crit has a 50% chance to automatically gather pickups. We like that. No explosives. We don't even look at the weapon. That's the new... I think we're just taking the watermelon. That sounds great. Every two shots trigger an explosion. Nope, not good enough. We need everything to be explosion. Beluga Cannon. I like the name of this one. I don't think it's worth us spending our resources on, though. Uh, just increase explosive damage by 10%. Yeah, we're, we're grabbing that. Should we upgrade this? Is it is it even doable? I mean, this... Oh, we did. Can we upgrade it again? No. I don't know if that was the right move. Uh, so apparently... Okay, so we're going into a cryo thing. Oh, I I strafed right into that damage. It's okay. We're we're pretty much back to full health. Which from almost dying in that one room uh feels pretty good. We should at least look at these weapons. Even if they're not high quality. Our poor drones have just been 100% neglected. Little buddy. Sorry about it. S what is this one? Sling gun. Uh, I think we're going to just pick it up. So it's, it is, projectiles are explosive, ricochets, one additional ricochet plus ricochet damage, explosion radius, first shot damage. Oh no. You like charge it up. Okay, we'll, we'll shoot like one enemy. As long as this isn't like a murder room coming up, this might be a murder room. Murder room. Okay, murder room, we got to just go with, go with the gun that got us here. Oh no, we didn't make our jump. We didn't make our jump. That's not good. We're getting slowed. The cryo murder room is very bad for us. OK, 
Okay, we've we've kind of stabilized the room now. Ugh. I quite like this gun that we have. All right, what are you offering us? I don't think we care. You gonna hide anybody around the corner for us here? I love that we can just go around corners blasting. We don't gotta aim nothing. If we're in the general facility, vicinity, you're dead. Power fists, hilarious. Oh, we've we've still not actually shot an enemy with. Uh, the ricochets off this were kind of awesome, though. I mean, I don't think it's better than our main gun. I will say the ricochets were very nice. But the way that gun shoots, not great for our playstyle. Ooh! Punchy Boy. Punchy Boy got angry at us. Flare gun. We're going to grab the flare gun just because it has the rocket jump. It's not fantastic but it's okay what you got back here back here data log finding the secrets he fully healed boomerang auto crit on return i mean sounds hilarious we're absolutely not buying that though Can we upgrade this? I mean, we're pretty deep. Nope, too high level. Uh, this should be a boss room. Which boss we got? Judge Ball? I think I've fought this one before. And it's a lot of stuff on the screen. Oh no. Oh no. That went so bad for us. I think those things are like magnetic. Can we gotta kill something or what do we gotta do? We gotta kill these things on the ground? Oh this is this is so bad. We're in like a DPS race against the boss. Oh, we took damage there. No! No, 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 no! No! Oh, we just got sniped there. You know what? That is okay. That was fun. Let's go to the base camp. Have a little peek around. Power crystals. Claiming power crystals unlocks permanent upgrades to the workshop. Check them out. Each crystal increases the amount of elite enemies you encounter, and they drop power cells on takedown. Okay. In addition, each crystal has a unique effect that reduces the difficulty of the final level. You can activate or deactivate the crystals you have claimed the crystal machine in the base camp. Okay, we don't we know nothing about that. The Brobot Lounge, the museum. What's over here? The workshop. So this is this is what we got. Is this the thing we bought? Uh, we pretty much bought everything here. Max deploys Lottery Luke, a friendly bot that can use your surplus wrenches to try to obtain gifts. I mean, we buy him, because I think we've bought everything.
So this is our red crystal. That must be that. Heisenbot sometimes joins Max Friendly Bot. Can craft corrupted items. I mean, we like that. So we need... We didn't unlock any more classes or anything, right? Taking a boss... So if we would have taken down that boss, we would have unlocked a new dude. By finding the chromatic cell. Oh, here's our... Crystal machine, unknown effect. I ah, we absolutely just have those on. No, we can, we'll just play on normal. Okay, well, that, I think that's it. Shooting range. Well, what is the point of this? What is the point of this? You can't have any weapons here, right? Oh God, we're so bad. We were not. We were not born to shoot guns, to aim guns. I should say, shooting them, shooting them, totally fine. It's the aiming part. The aiming part is brutal. Well, that's a world record right there, probably. Okay. All right, everybody. I think we're done for today. This was fun. Let me know if you want to see more of this. This game is just fun. I got nothing else to say. I'm out.